Okay guys, we're right here before Wrestle Rave. I'm right here with the owner of Local Wrestling, the promoter of Local What's Wrestling. Up? You've been in Local Rain Fire. Yeah, yeah. Jaime, Jaime, welcome What's back up, to WrestleBox, bro. For real, hey, we're like almost, what, a week away from uh, Local Wrestling, the good, the bad, and the fake, November 20th, guys. So, dude, it's we sold over 200 tickets. The show's almost sold out. Um, dude, we're excited, so fuck it, you know. Dude. Hey. Hell yeah, yeah, man. And we're uh, probably sponsoring Who and Dura area here in uh, for local, the good and bad and the fake. Yeah. Uh, his match is going to be Who and Dura area, yeah. Roxo, uh, Danny Chance, Izzy James, and Gino. Am I correct? Am yeah. I missing anybody? Uh, no, that's it. That's it. Hey, dude, there's, it's a five match scramble match. Your, your boy Russell Vlogs is sponsoring Hoovy. Dude, we got some of the best talent from across Texas. You know what I mean? In one match. So that just tells you these are like the creme de la creme of Texas right now and they're all in one match, dog, for real. So you got people from the Valley, yes. from Laredo, yes. Houston. Dude, it's gonna be an insane match. And I've seen every single person in this match perform. Yeah. And I can't wait what they can do. But yeah, man, uh November twentieth, uh we have uh, we just announced uh Dante Leon versus uh, Joe Alonzo in a steel cage match for the and it's uh sponsored by the Houston Premier Arena. So that's a shout out to Houston Premier Arena for sponsoring the cage match. And it's going to be Joe versus Dante for the title. And it's still cage match. So, guys, November 20th is going to be fucking ill. So, and uh, not only that, we got uh, Mickey Knuckles versus Saison in a local rules match. So, dude, we got some tough girls in the building. Yeah. Uh, we got Sarika and Roxy from Puerto Rico. If y'all don't know who Roxy is, trust me, after the 20th, you're going to know who she is. She's going to be on GCW, all the death matches, everything, dude. Roxy's going to be a fucking household name when it comes to like the deathmatch shit so yeah I mean, you probably will see her more at local you know yeah, for know. real yeah. for real you might never know man yeah so it's awesome man as well uh chris carter or sasf they've faced multiple times but i know local they're gonna tear the roof down on yeah the and, I, and you know what also i just want to give a shout out to uh golf coast jeff javino they're throwing a fucking banger ass show uh uh, what is it, uh, November the 19th, 19th. The 19th? Yeah, the night before Loco. Yes, guys, so if you're in that area, go check it out. ASF versus Chris Carter, but for the Gulf Coast, what is it? The, the Rising, Rising Stars Championship. Rising yeah. Stars Championship. Who knows what's going to happen? Maybe that the title might be defended that night. Who knows? Who knows, yeah. You yeah, never... for real, man. Jeff is yeah. the homie. I holler at him real quick on the phone. He said, let's, let's run the belt back. Let's run that match back over here for the title. Who knows? Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, shout out to Jeff from GCWA. Also, yeah. a great supporter from WrestleBlock and a great supporter for the Texas. Yeah, man, shout team, out man. to those guys. They, do, they throw bangers just like us, dog. Like, for real. They're, they're, they're as far as wrestling, they're, they, they, they feel my flavor palette when it comes to wrestling, dog. For real. Yeah, maybe someday we might see GCWA versus Local. Who, you never know. Whoa, <laughs> I love that. I love that. Man, you know, also, I in the future, we're going to do a collab with uh, ICW Legacy in Colorado. So, uh, maybe in 2022 we'll make some uh, some more uh, news and news and location and everything about that. So we're gonna do something cool as so. well uh, for local wrestling. The good, the bad, or the ugly. Ninja Mac versus Alex Zane Zane. for the first time on a one on one, guys. It was supposed to happen in Atlantic City for GCW, but they added Leo Rush to that, which was not a bad thing and not a bad thing at all. But uh, at the November 20th show, we're gonna have it for the very first time. What else are we going to see at Loco? Uh, we're going to have uh, La Raza Inquieta versus uh, Prince Canoe and Haywire. Guys, these are some like hidden gems from Houston. So, uh, dude, this is going to be a cool match. And uh, I can't wait to see it, dog. Like, I'm, I'm a big fan of both of their trainers, of these students. And uh, I just wanted to mix them up together, guys. So, I yeah, hope you all enjoy it. Shout out to my boy, R.I.P. Uh, Tugboy Taylor. He was a little legend around here in Houston. Shout out to him, dog. This is some of his last students. And uh, we have Lowrider versus Drago. Oh, yeah. Yeah, dude. Yeah. People sleeping on that one, dude. That's fucking fire, too, dude. It's going to be fire, man. Yeah, I can't wait for that. Uh, we got Drago from uh, Lucha Underground. And then we, you know, against Lowrider, the King of 420. Oh, yeah. King of 420. Yeah, so you already know it's going to be a good match. So I can't wait. Mm -hmm. I can't wait. The, the November 20th, uh, we're a week away from it. So you already know, Jello Shots for free, and we got a beer sponsor. Oh, awesome. yeah. Okay, Baycliffe Fish 
and uh, they're, uh, they're bringing Mas Lucha, their new beer is Mas Lucha. It's kind of like a, a Corona type beer, so the, it's going to be flowing in the flowing in the air that night, I guess. You know what I mean? But, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah really, you're going to be smelling that, that good aroma. <laughs> uh, right? It's going to be cool, though, yeah. I mean, for real. So I think that's uh, just about all the matches. Did we forget anything else? Um, trying to think. Uh, matches, matches, matches. I think that's it. Dude. That's it. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty much it. And as well, uh, tacos a la madre is gonna be here as well. Uh, yeah, tacos a la madre. Uh, Captain said Rich is gonna be here. Aces, uh, huh? Aces. Aces is gonna yeah. be here. Uh, Eighty Toys is gonna be in the building, and Texas Death Match. Uh, they're gonna be in the building also. So man, go peep them out. They got fire merch. I think uh, Texas Death Match just dropped the new Chris Carter shirt. Yeah. Yeah. So I think I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna go copy one. For real, so you better go to their website and go copy your Chris Carter shirt. Yeah, I've known there's people who come flying in from Puerto Rico, from all over the United States. Yeah. Uh, we've been driving like six hours or five hours to here, and it's it's worth it. The drive yeah. is worth guys. It. We have guys from uh, McAllen, uh, Brownsville, Corpus Christi, um, dude, uh, Dallas, for uh, San Antonio, all across uh, Texas. Uh, we got people from Chicago, Iowa, fucking Puerto Rico. Uh, Mexico, fucking, uh, and then pretty much everybody from Houston is uh, gonna fucking show up for November 20th, guys. We throw fire ass shows, trust me. I ain't even hyping it up, no cap, dog, for real. We throw the most banger ass shows, guys, for real. And I'll tell you one thing, dog, like, I know we're not on anybody's, uh, you know, 20, 21 year, you know, promotion of the year, yeah. but hey, dog, like, the work speaks for itself, guys. Uh, November 20th, uh, when we throw our show, we'll show you why we're like the promotion of the year, guys. For real, no cap on that one, dude. For real. Indeed, in my honest opinion, I think local wrestling is the promotion of the year. Yeah. It's the promotion that has opened more my eyes. I'm like, holy shit! Like, this is something I've been missing. Uh, that was at different places, but they don't. Uh, they don't have that hype anymore. They don't have that feeling anymore. And I finally began here at, at local wrestling. Yeah, we have the same feeling, the same vibe. The fans go crazy, guys. They get a little drunk, but uh, we love them for that. Uh, we have cool raffles, we have cool t-shirts, we have cool everything. We put the guys that y'all wanted to see, we'll look at, we're making the superstars up close and personal to y'all guys. Every uh, every show we throw. Uh, hopefully we got uh, January the 21st, Yasu Chiflaron Otra Vez. That's our next show. Uh, it's going to be on a Friday, except uh, this time around it's going to be on a Friday. So uh, we're going to, if you show up November 20th, you're going to find out what we got in store for the just that event and then we'll release it to the world to the another time uh -huh. to, uh, to the world maybe later but like the people that night get the first peek of what we got already they got the exclusive all right yeah i mean where can the fans get tickets if they're still available online uh, they, i know there's very very low uh big cartel slash local wrestling.com just look it up uh put a uh, big cartel local wrestling they'll pop up go to facebook you'll see all the ads um, go to my page, Jaime Martinez, and you'll see all the advertising advertisements for local wrestling November the 20th. The good, the bad, and the fake. Uh, there's still some tickets available. Uh, slide in my DMs if you want a good deal, group rates, and stuff like that. Uh, dude, uh, we don't know if there's going to be any seats left, so you better just hit me up and uh, we'll get you squared away for some tickets. Hell yeah. yeah. All right, man, we'll see you uh, next time, November 20th. We can't wait. He can't wait to be here, and uh, I'll be here enjoying the show. All right, yeah, yeah. hey guys, and if it ain't local, it, it ain't fine.